Roe v. Wade may be gone, but the fight over nationwide abortion access is just beginning, and boy, is it heating up fast. While the federal government seemed like a lame duck on the issue at first, that is no longer the case. NextNewsNetwork.com reports that on Tuesday, the Department of Justice filed a landmark lawsuit against a series of trigger laws put in place to restrict abortion access following the reversal of Roe v. Wade in the Supreme Court. The Fed said concerning the case that they were opposing the criminal prohibition on providing abortions as applied to women suffering medical emergencies, according to Attorney General Merrick Garland. This will be the first major piece of opposition from the United States government opposing the so-called trigger laws and their effect on the criminal justice system. Many states have been unsure how to grapple with this, especially in places where abortion was banned outright and people were scheduled to receive one for severe medical conditions. According to Attorney General Garland, quote, there.